before you watch this fucking video, I need you to drop a like. I'm no bitch in all my videos. You've never seen me begging for likes, but this took hours to set up and hours to film. I was pulling apart furniture, just making room. So I need you to like this video. I don't know how many, I think, fuck it. I think we, I think my most liked video has like 50 likes. If you beat that, awesome. But I just need some like recognition just for how much bullshit I had to set up. But yeah, enjoy the video. Uh, subscriber, special, collection video, whatever you want to call it. I'm actually filming this after the video, but I'm about to go clean all this up. And I'm going to fucking spend hours on it. But yeah, see y'all. All right. Oh, my God. Long awaited collection video. I'm going to call this 400, 500, and I'm kind of close to 600. But I'm not going to do one of these for a while because it's getting too much. This is the first time that I've done a video or a collection video where it's all out and laid out because it looks way better. And the pile it was just like, I don't know, it's kind of dumb. But I had to like cut each shoe off except for like two because I was just running out of space and I still don't have enough space like realistically. But I'm going to start back there and then work my way up. So some of this shit is Definitely gonna get stepped on, but whatever. All right. So I have all my vinyls back here, and then also, by the way, I'm trying to do this on one take, but vote Igor sign. I have the Call Me If You Get Lost vinyl, the instrumentals, and then the regular version of Cherry Bomb on vinyl, Feet of Clay, Blonde, and this is to show all of you people. The little Black Friday sticker on the back, because I got it when he dropped it originally. And then I have the three singles uh, in my room, Dear April, Cayendo. Then we have a bootleg of Bastard. Yeah, I'm, that sounded like a fart. I'm just trying to sit on, like, anything I can. But uh, got Bastard, Flower Boy, Odd Future Tape Volume 2, and then Endless behind that, Wolf. I don't like shit. I don't go outside. Then we got Goblin, Doris, some rap songs, Igor, Cherry Bomb, a bootleg of, or not Cherry Bomb, Channel Orange, a bootleg of Cherry Bomb. That came out before the original. And then we got Genesis, and then we got Nostalgia Ultra. And I'm gonna move back a little bit to see the hats. And then we have the Camp Vlog no hat, and then I have to fucking move back actually just now. But Golf Alicia's hat with the Lucas pin on the side. Golf hat with the cat pit on the side oh fuck yeah i'm like shaking trying to like get all this shit done i've been filming for like two hours but uh all this shit's on my instagram if you want like a more in-depth view but uh got the igor hat scumfuck flower boy golf of fleur hat pink g hat camp vlog no hat a wool g hat cheetah um cheetah print camp cap camp cap for polka dots the Kelly Green G hat, golf hat, new, or not new, but like new for me, golf Lafleur hat. I'm gonna like actually do this. Cherry bomb, uh, strap bag. I think this might be dead stock. Just like ordered it in like 2015. I always wear the green one. Uh, smiley face, and then we have ooh, corduroy with a little flower pin or smiley face pin, and then. Cherry bomb hat, pink script, green script, flog no motors with the cherry bomb patch. And that, yep, the insert just fell out of that. And then a golf six panel or five panel with that on it. Wolf hat, golf hat with the flog no pin or the stripe hat, whatever. The collegiate hat with the golf pin, the Tron cat pin, um, chicken and waffles, and then the light up hat where I popped the top off by accident like two years ago, but I never put it back on. I need to like glue it. And then the cherry bomb boonie. Oh my god, I'm like out of breath. Um, Alright, and then we have like mugs and some socks. 
So all the mugs, I'm pretty sure that have come out, but find some time, Golf Le Fleur, the Flower Boy, uh, Golf Pride, the Mussolini, Cherry Bomb, and then Cherry Bomb socks, Mellow Hype socks. I think these were called like Gelato or whatever, but I haven't worn them. Just didn't know like what to wear them with, but I knew they looked cool. Um, striped, checkered from like 2015, still dead stock. Um, donuts, striped socks. I always like wore these on the fourth. Um, fall, winter, or spring, summer 14. These are like fall, winter 13. Got those for free with those clear water shoes. And then all over cat print socks that are kind of annoying to wear. Uh, rainbow, flames, more stripes, more stripes. The, they're just like green kill cat, taco. And then, I'll just keep moving back, I guess. This is so unorganized because I'm just so fucking wired right now. Um, so, the boxers. So, I have the fingerprint ones, donuts, cigarettes, flames. And then I'm actually wearing the wear protection ones right now. I was like, I'm not about to take these off for a video. But, um, so, fun fact, in this video, there's one item missing, and it's that. But, uh, pink chinos, cherry bomb sh uh, jean shorts, the flames pants, and then these are the flame shorts. And then, going to the shoes, we have... The cream authentics, donut authentics, the donut skate highs with the little donut stitch on the back. Thought that was really cool. And then the slide, so I figured I'll keep both of those. The 2015, ugh. so one shoe says 20, or CFG, the other one says 2015, high tops. And then we have Earl's Lakai's from like 2014, the Golf Wang Vans from 2015 right here, the ones from 2014, and then the ones from 2013. They obviously say all golf on one shoe, wang on the other. And then all this stuff's on my Instagram, so you guys can just look it at look at it there for like more in depth. But uh the whole point of this video was mainly just like, okay, here's everything at once. And I said I would do it and I did it. But uh oh fuck I almost fell. So we got Grinch LaFleurs, the flame skate highs, these color blocks that I got from the mystery box two years ago i don't remember but kind of want to paint the bottoms and just have the green stitching accent but i don't know kind of lazy and i don't know if i'd like it but uh camp flogna or not camp flogna just golf lafleur normal chuck taylor highs the new golf lafleur 2.0 and then original golf lafleur who knows the green and blue and from the first pack all white and then we have another shoot from the mystery pack, which I think is pretty cool. Oh, God. Got the skate high, like, filler, velvet, or not, whatever, but really nice purple. Then we have Giannos, and then we have Camp Flogna 2014, less than, like, 100 made. But, uh, yeah, crazy shoe. And then I'm gonna actually, I said no cuts, but I'm gonna cut it right here because I think my phone's about to die and I'm gonna get my uh, little battery pack. All right, we're back. So I have the germanium pink, people call those Spider-Man, navy blue, um, the clear water ones. And then I'm holding these because I got a little detail on them, the little bees, all the stitching on them, the little like, not hidden phrase, but it's just kind of hard to see. And then people call those cotton candies. Oh God, cotton candy. Um, I have Cherry Bomb Soccer Ball from 2015, and then just, like, little accessory stuff, so Nail Polish Collection, the first one, I know we just put another one out, but Glitter, Orange, and then the Geneva Blue that he always has on. Um, this is the All Over Cat Wallet, but it, like, frayed a little bit, and I've just been using this card wallet for years, and then... I'm like bending over and I can't talk. Uh, French Waltz. What is this one? The 200 milliliters. But yeah, I haven't used it yet because I'm still using the little like 10 milliliter one. 
we still have like a little bit left in it, like halfway. And then some golf balls, like golf wing golf balls. <laughs> uh, I got a golf lighter. I'm trying to put this thing back in with one hand. So we got golf, a uh, golf lighter, some keychains. And then next is this golf wang Tron cat, uh, like little pendant that they gave away when Wolf came out. But people made a lot of fakes of those and I didn't get mine without the Jane because I was really stingy for money back then. But, uh, so that's that. I'm trying to think of where to go to next. I guess I'll go to like the stuff I have hung up in my closet. So I have the flame puffer jacket. I didn't even attempt to fold that because I knew it wouldn't fucking fit anywhere. But then chicken and waffles button up, flame button up. We have uh, the Odd Future Donut sweatshirt with a little cross on the back. Tie-dye donut. Goblin crew neck. Uh, no nukes button up. I think that was called like 30 millimeter, whatever. Just has like a little embroidery on there. But I really like the uh, collars on it. The long sleeve polo to match the red and blue shoes got this sunflower flower boy button up the like checker print crew necky thing and then another button up for flower boy like daisies on it i think this was called an eric polo watermelon polo cigarette button up i don't remember the name of this but it has it's just like red blue and then yellow with white cuffs and a white collar with the cursive logo like it really look like some 80s stranger things type shit but uh cheetah print button up the cherry bomb long sleeve crew or uh checkerboard polo the um the blue green and then orange uh all over cat print crew neck with the buttons and the little drawstring uh, a golf wing basketball jersey, and then the grandpa jacket. And then I think we're ready to go on to the t-shirts now. And I'm just going to like... I'm going to figure out how to do this. Fuck it, I'll just do this. Just fucking free ball it. So we got the wolf anniversary t-shirt that I need to wash and like restretch. I've had this for years, but I haven't like fixed it yet. Um, the NBA leather Earl sweatshirt, sick, like, long sleeve tour shirt. Uh, call me if, you, or not call me if you get lost. The call me sometime, like, 911, uh, golf wing shirt. And then, speaking of call me if you get lost, the album cover t-shirt that came with the bundle, which I'll show you guys in a second. Uh, golf with Fleur T for when they came out with, I think it was the two-tone shirts, but that's a really good quality shirt. Have the soccer jersey, the fake, like, Juventus one, uh, flame logo, uh, uh, the box cutter tie-dye shirt, polka dot shirt. Have the kittens and crowns button up along with the balloons button up. Have a watermelon odd future tee, cherry bomb tee, Tron cat tee. That one says, who the fuck are you? From the song Special. And then there is a blue just donut that one says let's fuck right now kind of weird i don't think i've ever worn that shirt um inhaler shirt from wolf and then that logo's bigger on the back earl t from like super long ago the og like earl logo the blue tiger stripes uh that came with the cherry bomb documentary i don't know do that and stand up more so i can talk clearly uh, Camp Vlog, or not Camp Vlog, no, Vlog on Motors, but not the Camp Vlog, no one with the car on the back, that one just has the 14, uh, that one says, what is prayer gonna do, that Rhonda shirt that I'll show you guys the deck of, uh, probably at the end, because I know YouTube doesn't give a fuck about coming through my video, and maybe they do, I don't know, um, I don't like shit, I don't go outside, the Earl Tour T, uh, Golf Mussolini Tour T, that, cross t it's bigger on the back as well and then let's go like that way so igor t with the bundle uh like a lego t because i really like legos when i was a kid and i still kind of do but i just haven't bought them in a while a fake beamer t because i wasn't about to spend 500 dollars on that and socks so 
like my dirty little secret. I have a fake Beamer tee, but rest assured, all of this shit is real. Like, that's the only fucking thing. So, the two, uh, the American flag tee and the gay pride tee, the 10th anniversary of the Odd Future Tape Volume 2, the tour shirt I got for Call Me If You Get Lost in D.C., uh, Scumfuck Flower Boy, shirt from the bundle, the, this sunflower tea where it has, like, the breakdown of all of the different parts of the flower, uh, the fake Bubblicious, Golfalicious tea, I say fake is in parody, not fake, but, uh, Suicide Starter Kid, real edgy tea, uh, that's Save the Bees, it says, like, the little copyright flower boy, that's Save the Earth, with, uh, like, an eyeball in the Iris's mother, or his earth, and it's crying. There's the Some Rap Songs tour tee. Igor tour tee. I probably said these, but whatever. Uh, the ASAP Rocky Entirely Creator tour. Didn't go on it, just bought the shirt. The glitter tee, what I really thought was, I bought the white one with the pink glitter, but whatever. And then an Odd Future Raglan from, like, 2011... The tiger stripe shirt that he wore in IFHY's video, popsicle tee, uh, Jesus Cross tee, this is my god, like the Pemberton exclusive Tumblr made uh, inhaler shirt, really fucking like that. Jesus is missing on like a milk carton t-shirt. We got the wolf sketch tee with the Slater on the back, no tour dates. Uh, the trackless t-shirt for Cherry Bomb, all over cat shirt, this one with like a cat wearing a headband and it has like gold foil, odd future on the bottom, Trisha fashion show tee, just a can't flog no shirt, this striped like rainbowy shirt, uh, flog no cat, that was for Flower Boy tour with Vince Staples, and then that is the like wavy uh, yellow and blue tee. I gotta, like, watch where I'm stepping. And then, Ogaka California t-shirt. I was about to wear that today, and I was like, let me take this off and fucking film this video. Um, you can't see it, but that's the 100% off t-shirt from Blonde when Frank Ocean gave away a free t-shirt when the uh, Blonde vinyl came out. Got really fucking lucky with that. And then I always bring it up. Ooh, if you ever talk to me, that story, but... It's a really funny story. I mean, it's not like a long story, but it's just, I don't know, I got lucky. Um, this is a, like old English uh, long sleeve with like a crazy weird monster on the on the back. Sometimes t-shirt. And then I guess I'll go over these ones that I have in bags. So these are like my retired-ish t-shirts. So I have cream golf wing shirt. It's just kind of old. Same with the Camp Flockno shirt and the Donut shirt, because they're just kind of chipping on the graphics, and they're, like, 10 years old. Um, that Kill, or the Shark Cat tee, again, it's just, like, really stained and kind of gross, because it's from 2011, when they, like, kind of did their first American tour. That's dead stock, that um, Black Flames tee. I got lucky on a restock, maybe in, like, 20... 19 or some shit but uh oh yeah that's the 20 like the new version and same with that one in the back because i got him when i got the uh chuck taylor's but dead stock that's dead stock polka dot t-shirt um and then that's dead stock as well the trump t-shirt because it says 2016 to 2020 but i didn't know if his ass was about to get reelected. and then golf wang like striped t but the thing is that logo peels very easily. Like, I literally washed it once and it was starting to peel. So I was like, okay, fuck that. And the last thing in a bag is just this cherry bomb floaty. Because I was like, I'm not, I'm not pumping this up. Like, I had it pumped up for a while. But then I was just like, it's taking up too much goddamn space. And all this stuff in bags, I just keep in, like, my closet. And then more socks are those fake Beamer socks, like I was mentioning. You can tell they're fake because it says golf wang. It should say wang golf. Like those ones it's just wang golf or the blue yellow and red ones in the back damo cheetah print socks got some odd future watermelon socks 
Um, those are from fall, winter, 14, those socks. Wolf socks, cherry bomb, and then these ones are cool. They have, like, golf, the cross, wang on the foot. And then I'll move on to the, the boards and, like, bags and stuff. So to match that button up that I have, I have this scumfuck flower boy deck that I kind of want to hang up, but I still have it in the plastic. And then this is that Rhonda one. This is from like 2015. But uh, yeah, I'll just show that real quick. Actually, I'll show like the front. Yeah, but you can tell what that was just from the click. Oh, that was loud. A quick glimpse. And then got this golf backpack from... I bought it in Baltimore when Tyler came in 2015 for Cherry Bomb. But it was originally at the 2014 Carnival where... I can't get over it. Where those shoes came out. Or not came out because they weren't released. But, uh, yeah. Got a Camp Flogna, I think 2019 flame backpack that they fucked around and gave for me for, gave to me for free so yeah it's pretty sick oh i just noticed something i didn't talk about but i'll get to it and then uh 2015 camp vlog no or not camp vlog no fuck me just golf wing stripe backpack with a little cat on the back i always use that whenever i go somewhere but yeah i realized i didn't talk about these it's just golf moleskin books just like sketchbooks and then, ooh. and then, needless to say, I have a bunch of golf bags from just whatever shirts came in. They're all, like, folded up somewhere in, like, a closet. But, uh, yeah, we only got, like, two, like, three more sections. And I know this video is already pretty long, but I feel like it could have been a lot longer. But, cool. So I have some, actually, I'll go over this. So... When the election happened in 2020, yeah, Frank sent out a bunch of things. I just didn't open it, but it's the same poster on the actual postcards. But, yeah, he sent it to anybody who had ever bought anything from Blonde. But, uh, yeah, just like a little election thing for, like, a reminder. And then this is just an Igor poster. So... Vote, e Ooh. Vote Igor, I think I got it when I got the vinyl or something. But yeah, they stay giving out free posters. And then I got the Fader magazine from 2014 when he was talking about Cherry Bomb coming out. Double uh, XL cover. The Golf Book from 2015, this one's crazy. Uh, golf Wing Picture Book from 2011, and then... This was like an editorial from 2018 where he just kind of showed off the stuff that he had made for that season of golf. And then let me cut this and then move around instead of having just an... Oh, God, I keep burping. Like an awkward inserted clip. And then this is the Boys Don't Cry Frank Ocean magazine. Insane. It's like, it's like 10 pounds. Comes with a CD copy of Blonde and a bunch of like interviews and stuff. Really sick at, like, I have an elite coffee book collection because I have some basketball books upstairs, all this shit. But, yeah, can't fuck with me with the coffee books. Coffee table books. <laughs> and then we'll move on to, like, the CDs and stuff. So we have the deluxe version of Goblin. Haven't opened it. Probably won't. Uh, the deluxe version of Wolf, regular version of Goblin. Doris, Wolf, Wolf. Channel Orange, Odd Future Tape Volume 2, uh, Cherry Bomb, Cherry Bomb, Numbers by Mellow Hype. These three are cherry. Fucking phone died in the middle of that, so switched over to the fucking iPad, and this shit is insane because the screen's so big, the film, but cut off at those three are Cherry Bomb, and then we got Blonde, but you never really see these, I don't think, on CDs or not going to CD anymore. It's always just the vinyl. Um, if this looks a little shitty, I'm sorry. Okay, that should be better. I just wanted to get like a bigger angle, but uh, I got Flower Boy. Oh God, I don't know where the camera is. And then Endless on CD and DVD, showing like the 45 minute um movie. 
Call Me If You Get Lost, some rap songs, Igor. And then this is the... I'm trying to like look through the viewfinder and I keep like misaiming. So this is... Oh God, focus. Focus. Whatever. Um, the... Oh my God, cassette of unreleased beat called Girl 45 and the original version of Answer that came out with the Wolf documentary. Like I said, only like 98 out there because they made 100 and then two went, one went to Tyler, one went to Mikey who filmed it. And then we got, oh God, I keep misaiming. Got Flower Boy on the white cassette. We got this little Buff Fleur book that has like product info. Um, the Wolf DVD of Tyler making the album. It's like 45 minutes. It's all it's on YouTube. Same with the Cherry Bomb one. I don't know if I mentioned it, but here's the Wolf photo book. I said that really weird. But yeah. Signed. All that stuff. It's got a few photos in it. Um, Illegal Civilization 3 box set. I'm I don't know. I included it just because. But yeah. And then from when uh tour happened. Call Me If You Get Lost, it's a stamp, this one's a compass, lanyard, quote unquote VIP thing, but didn't really do shit for you, pin, I got a patch, Jesus Christ, pick it up, and then some socks, which is pretty sick, um, yeah, so I got like one more group of things to go over, and that's just like, stickers and that type of shit but i'm going to not do that here i'm gonna try to find like a flat area to do that at very quickly that is the cherry bomb sign poster again it's on my instagram that is the call me if you get lost tour poster then this is the vote igor poster but it's pink and then i just actually realized something as well <gasps> I have the Flames belt here, a little golf stamp on the side, and then as well as that, I have not seen one of these for sale in years, but it's the first belt that they ever released. It's got the little cat on the side, and then the other end has golf, like, lasered in, but yeah, I'm gonna get to these stickers and all that stuff. Fucking hangers I had from all the stuff that I was, uh ripping off but yeah sticker time right. so here's the igor wig from igor's tour it has a yellow button and a pink button but uh got a vote igor like 3m sticker some of these aren't all golf wang some of them are like supreme or just like other shit but uh i'll, I'll only go over like the big things but like, yeah it's like some buttons that came uh, with, I think, one of the hats that I have. Yeah, the Igor hat. It's like a bundle. Big-ass face sticker. And there's the big-ass face sticker in the wolf vinyl. Yeah, it's just a bunch of, like, I never really put stickers in the orders. Like, they used to always do free stickers. I don't think they do that anymore. Big. Right? It's like a bumper sticker from one of Logic's old albums. Um, yeah, like, it's cool, I don't know, just a bunch of stickers, like, if I ever had a clear phone case, I'll just put them in the back of it, not actually stick them onto my phone, because I'm a massive pussy, but, just... yeah, just some crazy stickers, I have so many of these, because they used to always give these out, the bastard face in there, it just says, wolf, fuck. There we go. Yeah, the camera is in the bottom right corner for me. I've like never filmed anything on this iPad, but it's very... I'm not familiar with it. Ooh! So we got an old-ass air freshener from 2014. It still smells. It smells like watermelon. Um, Wrinkled-ass spring shirt. Or oh, this is cool. The punk face sticker 
And then I see, yeah. So the packaging, like the glue got too dry and just popped off, but some golf dice. And, oh yeah, I got some, some pins in here too. Yeah, man, I got a ton of shit. Another air freshener. Can't really smell that. Miscellany face. But yeah, dude, that's it. Full fucking collection video. Look at all that. Like, don't play with me. But uh, yeah, man, this is probably the last video for a while. Just haven't really been buying shit. Um, and yeah, fucking like this video. This took, I'm, I'm pulling furniture apart and shit. And this, I, I think I started filming this at 7.30 or 7. Yeah, it's 10.25. And I'm going to be doing this until midnight easily. So like this fucking video. I'm about to film another video. And uh, fucking check out the Instagram. If you follow me on Instagram, you know how I've been setting all this up. But yeah, man. I'll see y'all soon. I forgot one thing. Thanks for watching. I haven't even put it all back yet, but I've been up those up and down those stairs like a hundred times. I'm fucking gassed. <laughs> I lied. I'm putting everything back and I forgot to take this off the shelf. So that picture was forgetting three things in total i've been cleaning for hours but i forgot a key like golf just but i mean this is uh, that's how tired i am it's such a part of my life that i just see this shit every day and forget about it but yeah all right i'm about to like wrap this up but um shit's basically packed away it's been a few hours because i like actually you know did something with my life and hung out with people but just to like show you, I have a few more stickers just on my wall. Or this is my door. <laughs> and then, uh, yeah. So that was on my phone and then it peeled off. But, uh, do I? Yeah. Little cross. Um, yeah, put all these shits back. And then I have a Flyboy poster that came with the bundle up there. Cherry Bomb, both sides from came with the CD. And then just some tour posters from when I saw Earl and Tyler. A fake Frank Ocean poster that I got off eBay. And yeah, just like a bunch of tags and shit. Just shit I've hung up, but uh, 